All right, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to this episode of Making Magic Fishing. Um, where's the light? Where do I look better? Do I look better now? Maybe now? Anyways, as you can see, I'm getting rigged up. This is the last pole I'm gonna get rigged up. It's my trolling pole. It could be like a flipping, I don't know. It's, it's a bait caster. One of the first ones I ever bought on i think the pole that caught the five pounder anyways we're staying here at this airbnb no way it's not an airbnb it's a it's a cabin at the lake that i'm um, fishing for these trout i got two uh poles rigged up already i got one more that i'm gonna get rigged right now i'm gonna go get the catfish rods out there all right so I almost forgot. We're staying at this cabin. It's a pretty freaking sick one. It's got this porch, balcony. We got a cabin neighbor. We got the restroom, the park right on the other side. Over there, over yonder way is water. We got one dude over here camping in a tent in his van. He's rocking out. We got a couple other neighbors over that way. Looks like some more restrooms. Let's go inside and check it out. Alright, so it's fully loaded in here. It's fully stocked. We uh, got down some tacos. Uh, didn't didn't bring you guys along for that, but it's got pretty cool big sink, microwave, toaster. We're gonna make some breakfast, bacon and eggs, potatoes in the morning. We got a bed. Looks like Cody's been in here, of course. Mom made it, it looked all perfect and neat. But uh, yeah, Cody destroys everything. We got a nice bathroom, shower. So, so if you guys are ever in the Kachuma Lake area and you guys want to rent a cabin and you guys are unsure of how they look exactly inside, how big they are, if they have one bed, two beds, this one actually has two beds and I guess it's for uh, a minimum of four people or up to four people one of the two I don't know but um I recommend this these are like all freaking brand new redone remodeled um, pretty pretty freaking cool if you ask me so um, yeah I'll go ahead and show you what else we got Cody got his projector going we got mom and the baby baby's getting big He's already texting. He's already learning how to text. Um, we got fully uh, stocked with a fridge. I mean, not fully stocked, but uh, this did come with a fridge and and a freezer, I guess. Both of them seem pretty pretty legit. And then um, we got like this table guy. We already got a TV, but Cody got a projector for his birthday, so. And Baby yeah, a full another room. His face in the did he? In the phone. Are you ready to put your clothes back on and go cast out the poles? Okay. All right, come along with us. Stay tuned. All right, Cody, point the light at me. Okay, because I couldn't see. Now let's stay on the trail. All right, you guys, welcome back. We are going down to throw the catfish rods out as you can see there is no moon tonight and not well actually there's a bunch of stars but the stars don't light it up there's just no moon at all and we're nearly falling down this trail right now cody's doing a good job of lighting it up though we made it down the hill now we're gonna No, no, look at, look at, this is where, this is where we, this is, come on, come on, hey, 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 this is where we do it right here, this is the tree stump that I see, we're gonna go to this tree stump, by going this way, no, not that one, closer to the water, yeah, down here more. 
Yeah, this one. All right, you guys. So here's the stump. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see this, but pick your bug. We got three rods. I got to get them untangled because they're all tangled up a little bit. I'm using this bait, the one that worked, uh, has worked before, tried and true. I don't want to. It's a uh, catfish chunks, chicken blood, treble hook. That's what I got. That's the rig I'm using, treble hooks and weights. Come along with me. Let's see if we can make some magic happen. Huh, cow. All right, good morning. What's up, you guys? Maybe uh, some of you locals out here and uh, might know where we're at or exactly as far as where we're driving. We are the first boat, it looks like. The sun hasn't even broke yet. This lady's looking at us like we're crazy. But um, it looks like there's one other boat that maybe she let down already, so I'm super excited. Cody, you happy? We got to go um, get the boat launched and talk to you guys in a little bit. You ready? Let's go. All right, the sun hasn't even reached over the mountain crest yet, or the mountain tip. There's one boat in front of us. We're the very second boat. I'm super excited. I'm trying to get Cody to run, but it's too early. All right, talk to you guys in a minute. Alright, you know how to do this part? Whoa. Okay, get in there. It's all wet on there, so don't sit down yet. Good morning, you guys. We got the good old coffee in a glass. And the sun just came up. We're doing our first troll. I'm super excited. This is such an awesome day, such an awesome morning. Everything friggin' has me super jacked on life right now. So bear with me if I'm a little too excited to say the right things or say a cool thing. Um, Anyways, come along with us. We're gonna try to make some magic happen. All right, talk to you guys in a little bit. Hopefully we get one. Don't don't wing it around too much like that. You want to just like hold it still. Hey, hold it to the side on this side. Come on, hold it to this side over here. Cody. Yeah, just leave it like that and leave it real still and you'll get one. Just leave it like that. Come on, Cody. All right, we'll talk to you guys in a minute. Cody's still messing around. Man, this ghostly fog we got here, Cody. I feel a change in the wind. This ghostly fog is like steam, I guess, coming off the water. It's weird. Pretty cool, though. All right, that's it for this check-in. Cody got his rod up in the little eye up there of that the tip of the boat such a silly head cody you having fun you're gonna have more fun when we get one right now so hang on all right what's up you guys so i don't know if you can see me probably not i'm going over the edit i'm in the car or i'm going over this edit and i didn't really close this video out it's kind of a messy video so bear with me uh, appreciate you guys watching if you guys made it this far 
I'm still out here, graveyard shift, editing, grinding. Like, comment, subscribe. I really appreciate all the support, all the new support, all the ongoing support. Shout out to every single person that comments on my videos. You guys know who you are. Keep commenting. I'll, uh, you know, stay up as much as I can on everybody who comments. You guys are going to get a comment right back. You guys are going to get a sub right back. Keep showing me support. I'll keep showing your channel support. Appreciate you guys watching. Had a I had a really good time taking Cody out on this trip. He uh, we woke up super early. We didn't get any fish. This was the day that I got skunked completely. We rented a cabin. We spent the night. We did some catfishing. I got skunked on the catfish. Yeah, we caught no. We got no bites on the catfish. I guess all the trout that got planted. I think that they just nibbled the bait off because all the hooks just kept uh, having no bait on them or whatever. So I don't know what's going on with that, but we're going out tomorrow. We're gonna do a little family shore fishing. We're gonna go for the trout. We're gonna go from shore. We're gonna use that power bait that everybody says they've been catching them on. We're gonna take some lawn chairs. We're gonna take the baby. It might be raining, so I don't know if it's gonna work out 100%. But we're going to try to make it out there, rain or shine. I'm rambling already. I don't know how long this outro is going to be. But thank you guys for watching. Love you guys. Stay tuned for the next video. And as always, go out there. Make some magic happen.